in the first section of this, you uh, interview a group of gamers about sexual harassment in mm-hmm. gaming. What made you want to cover that topic, or sexual harassment specifically in the gaming in world? In gaming. Well, I read an article about a woman who was playing a game that had, like, a multiplayer function, and she was in her brother-in-law's house with her husband playing this video game. She opened it up to multiplayer, and all of a sudden, this guy, she had, this, she had like, a generic avatar but a female voice, and he started running after her and groping her. And she was, like, giggling, but he, like, wouldn't stop. Like, a char- as a character in the game. As a character in the game, in VR, he was, like, chasing her and groping her. And, and I'm sorry. I'm- <laughs> and um, he, and she was, like, it, it was an assault, but it felt like it. And that was so fascinating. And then she, we tried to actually get her to talk to us, but she went underground and isn't doing interviews because she got, like, doxxed and harassed after the fact. So I realized that it was like a really interesting issue. And then I kind of, I did a little more research on it and just saw like how endemic it is and how, and this isn't really in this show because it's not as funny, but a lot of times like, you know, harassment and gaming can extend into reality where like someone will be, you know, teasing someone online and then the person online will typically woman kind of joke back and then it, in the case of someone I had talked to, it extended to like stalking and like in-person encounters. And so it is a really scary issue that we kind of take lightly because we're like, oh, this is gaming. Mm -hmm. 